hello everyone welcome again and i'm going to continue the java web application project and uh, in the last video we've seen like how to create a setup environment and how to create a start a project on sts tool or you can say eclipse so uh, if you know how to configure that complete project by maven tool so you can continue this video if you don't know please check the description box it's a videos of the, the link uh, you will find the link of previous video so you will easily get that uh, how to configure that particular project a particular project and using the maven tool or eclipse id and uh, how to configure that server tomcat server and all that things so i'm going to continue this tutorial again and um, so in this tutorial we will see how to configure particular mbc architecture in your project mbc is not a tool it's a just a way of programming how you can uh, differentiate your code like uh, there will be different different phases of code like view part controller part which will control your application and uh, uh, model part or you can say business part or you can say bean classes or different different phases are there so mo model view controller is uh, if you don't know what is model view controller it's just a simple way of programming and uh, model and which is contain the business classes or you can say database classes and controller which will help to communicate a view part to database or server you can say so it's kind of server server side program you can take the server as a controller and uh, view part is an important part for the user and the main front of the application uh, which will uh, user will interact with that view part so we are going to configure that uh, mbc architecture in this project so we will uh, let's continue <coughs> there is a folder java resources inside this java src main java we are going creating a different different packages are there so first we are going to create a bean classes folder so this for this uh, uh, package or you can say folder or package so this package will contain all your bean classes and another package will be com dot java web application dot model it will contain your business classes and logic classes finish and the next com dot java web application dot controller this controller package will contain all that uh, your servlets and uh, in model package we will insert all the database connectivity code or business logics and this bean classes is just used for the data setter this bean package will hold the complete data setter classes or bean classes so it's a uh, enough for model and controller and if we talk about the view part so inside the src main java um src bayweb there is a folder in bayweb inside this all the file like jsp html your images your css will come will come under this bayweb package so we are going to create some folders there so image images one folder is images this folder will contain all the images of particular project or you can say css this will contain your all your css and again a folder js it will contain your javascript files and uh, we can create one jsp or html folder also if you want jsp it will contain your jsp file so bear web folder will come under the view part it will contain all your required things which will help you as a view part and uh, <coughs> you can see here there's uh, three packages are there first one for bean classes second one is controlled and third one is model so this way you can configure your project your mbc architecture inside your project and uh, next in very next tutorial we are going to continue that programming 
and uh, how to create your first uh, program or uh, your how to create your first uh, mostly we will work first on the login and registration module so 